Hello Aries, it's my lady and this is my lady's way tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly express weekend in stone reading for the week of, hmm, in the week of August 25th through the 28th, 2023. The cards I'm using today are Tarot of the Elves by Mark McElroy. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, let's fix this. All right, what's going on with the Aries? Okay. Mm. What's going on with the Aries? Mm, mm, mm. I'm hearing choices, choices, choices. Aries, Aries. Aries, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. So we got the king of coins here. So I do feel like with this king of coins... I feel like somebody is in some kind of leading position. I do feel like somebody is very generous, caring. Um, I do feel like that's what time and money, okay? Physical, material things, okay? All right, so we got the four coins here. So I do feel like somebody may be in a leading position, but I do feel like somebody may be having some money problems, okay? I feel like money got money tied up, and I do feel like it may be because somebody is giving too much, giving too much, doing too much, okay? In that sense, okay? So we're going to pull one more card for down here. But we'll see what's going on there and there. Let me put this here so that... Look at my clumsy self. Look, I'm about to ruin some stuff. I'm going to just put it up here. <laughs> all right. So, it looked like, yes, yeah, somebody got money tied up all over the places. And I do feel like it's because um, somebody's giving too much. Because now we got the King of Cups here. So, I do feel like I'm giving a lot to people. I'm caring about people. Um, but I do feel like I'm being left out of a lot of things, okay? I feel like I'm giving so much to other people. Be and it's like uh, stopping me from doing things that I want to do for myself, okay? So, somebody needs to find that line in between helping other people and helping themselves, okay? So, we got the sun card here. So, I do feel like um, helping... Other people is what makes this person happy. Uh, but I also feel like it's what's hurting this person as well. But I do feel like um, somebody is happy in the biggest picture. But I do feel like somebody is starting to feel how they're being left out because of um, all this giving away. All right. So we got the death card here. So I do feel like somebody's stuck in some kind of trap. I do feel like somebody's stuck in some kind of toxic relationship. Um, something should be over, but somebody is not like letting go of it. And I do feel like whatever this is, somebody is not letting go of is the uh, reason of all of the issues and the problems that are going on right now. So it's like somebody is giving, giving, giving to someone or uh to, or some something and i do feel like this is putting me into i'm barely paying being able to pay for my stuff um and it's just becoming a, a not so great toxic situation because it's like you're getting everything you need but i'm not getting anything i need okay so now we have the nine of swords this just broke my insides in half um the nine of swords definitely a lot of anxiety nightmares lack of sleep all of those are one are happening because of all the stuff that's going on okay and it's just like i love caring i love giving but it's definitely a time when you got to realize if somebody is just using you to use you up other than you know using you to get up okay because i feel like this is what's going on i just want to use somebody to use them up and then you know i just need some help Okay, help on the way. All right, so we got the Ace of Swords reversed here. So I do feel like somebody is not giving up yet. Uh, 
well, uh, maybe next week. But it looked like somebody is not giving up on this person yet. I feel like I haven't found enough evidence to make me feel like I should leave right now. Um, but I also feel like somebody feels like and know that they're losing when it comes to their self. And it's just like, I just got to come up with something or some kind of way or just some kind of evidence to help me uh, feel comfortable leaving this situation. Um, but it looked like somebody is definitely just taking on somebody else's issues as their own. And this is like, I don't know, I feel like this is a... a no, I don't want to say black and white, but that's it. <laughs> it's just like this or is either them or you kind of thing. But I do understand caring about somebody and wanting to help. But you got to understand when the line between I won't help or I just want everything you have. Okay. But I do feel like I want everything you have energy here. Okay. Even if it's not that I want everything you have energy you got to stop when you start hurting yourself, okay? And I had to learn that the hard way, okay? So this probably could be a reading for me too. That retrograde energy is like, I um used to always put other people in front of myself and to hurt, like I would, somebody would actually be standing on my hand and I didn't want to say anything because I didn't want to inconvenience them, okay? This actually happened before. And this is the situation like this. It don't matter if it's physically, mentally, emotionally. When you letting somebody hurt you to get forward or somebody is hurting you to get forward, you got to say something about it or do something about it because it's just going to keep hurting and get worse and worse. And it might be a time where you're not able to get out, okay? But we hope it don't go there. But let's see what's at the bottom of this deck. So we got the Eight of Swords here. So I do feel like somebody um, is getting ready to send some kind of message out. And I do feel like uh, somebody going to change their actions right away. Okay. So if you tell this somebody that you're not going to help them no more, you're going to get the answer that you need right away. Okay. Like whether it be like, oh, okay, I'm sorry. Or, you know, oh, thank you. You know, or, oh, you could have that manipulating crap. OK, then you're going to be able to see that line between who is using you and who is like, you know, really just appreciate and need your help. OK. All right. Well, let's see what's in here. All. We're getting close to the bottom, y'all. Friends, dream and strength. OK, so I do feel like, of course, this is a friend of somebody's. It's like I care about you and that's why I'm doing what I need to do for you. Um, but we got this dream card here. This dream card makes me feel like even though we friends, I want more for us or I want more for you. OK, and I do feel like the strength card is, is I mean, card, well, it's going to be a card right now. OK, but stone. <laughs> All right. So the strength stone is like whatever choice you make, you got to stick with it. OK, so even if this person is going to do the right thing, like, OK, yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm almost where I need to be. You still got to cut your things off. You still got to cut it off. Um, even if this person try to manipulate you, you still going to need that strength to say, okay, and walk away from this person. Okay. So the thing is, is you're going to need this strength to walk away and your dream, you know, I don't know. I feel like it's a 50, 50 chance of somebody wants to know like how, what's going to come out of this. But for some of them, if the people that you helping, they are going to get up and get to where you need. But also the people who are using you, they're going to show their face. Uh, that's, a, that's a dream that most of us don't want to see or hear. But I do feel like that's going to be the reality for some of us, okay? Um, but I do feel like the ones that are doing and being right, you are going to end up becoming better friends and closer together. And I feel teary a little bit right now because I feel like this is going to be one of those relationships, those lifetime relationships, like a this person is going to get on their feet and they always going to be there for you. Okay. But I don't know if I said this in this reading, but could be some retrograde energy. Um, somebody from that past is going to come help you out when you need them. So that little bit of help that you help to get them up, they're going to be right where you need them to be when you need somebody to help you. Okay. But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your month. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, <laughs> sun, moon, and rising signs. 
Thanks for watching.